believe and pray that this video is going to find whoever needs to see it tonight. I want to pray for those who are struggling in their faith, who are unsure about their standing with God. And so Lord, I just lift these people up to you right now in the name of Jesus. I lift them up to you, God. Right where you're sitting, Jesus, at the right hand of the Father. Where you sat down and you finished the work. I thank you, Lord, that you did everything. You finished everything. There's nothing that we've done to give us right standing with you. There's nothing that we can do to make us right with you, Lord. You said that even our best deeds are like dirty rags, Lord. And even while we were still sinners, you loved us. <laughs> Thank you so much, Father. God, I pray for those who are still struggling to believe still struggling to trust in you and your faithfulness, God, still wondering if they're too much of a mess, too broken, for you to love, for you to save, for you to take care of, and for you to grow. I pray that they would know you, God, are more than enough for them, that all they need is in you, that everything flows out of knowing you and having relationship with you. God is asking us just to put everything aside and just walk with him. Just take his hand and trust him because he'll lead you every single step of the way and he's not going to let you go. Whatever you're dealing with tonight, whatever you've been dealing with the past 10 years, none of it is too big for him or too scary. None of it is pushing him away from you. He's right there, he sees you, he knows you, and he loves you unconditionally. And I promise you that will never change. It's time to let go of it. Stop holding on to these things so you can hold on to his hands. That's all that you need. Everything else will fall into place. You are secure in him. Let me read you a verse. I'm going to read you Ephesians chapter 1, starting at verse 13. But I encourage you to read all of chapter 1. Verse 13 says, In whom ye also trusted, just trusting in Christ, after that ye heard the word of truth, you heard the gospel of your salvation, in whom also after that ye believed, ye were sealed with that Holy Spirit of promise, you were sealed with his Holy Spirit the moment you believed on him and trusted in Christ. Do you trust in Christ? Do you believe in him? Do you know that he is the way, the truth, and the life? Then you have the Holy Spirit and you are sealed with that Holy Spirit. Trust in him that he's bigger. He's big enough to hold on to you and not let go. He won't. God bless you.